Welcome to my channel. My name is Rosie O. And today I'm going to show a small Timu order of a painting style that I really love. <laughs> and if you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, hope you enjoy the show. <laughs> so this past Wednesday, I believe I showed all flowers. So this time I'm going to show all coffee cups or tea cups. Or cocoa cups <laughs> well actually cups cups of hot chocolate so and i love the images with all of that with tea sets tea cups coffee cups and all that if you're a returning viewer you've probably seen a lot of my previous <laughs> paintings that have pretty much cups as well so i gathered this one this time this theme is gonna be cups <laughs> so you would just remove the painting from the little plastic packet and you'll receive your diamonds and your standard kit. And, ooh, these diamonds are loose, meaning usually they're in a little plastic wrap within the painting so that they're all stay together. I've been seeing it in larger paintings, but I haven't believe I haven't seen. Ooh, sorry, the wording was off. <laughs> I haven't seen loose diamonds in small ones. Not that I remember, but I do love the tones on it. As you can see, a whole bunch of different browns and earthy tones and all of that whole bunch of white which i know is the background <laughs> let me put that aside real quick and your standard kit so just in case you're new to diamond painting the standard kit includes the tray the wax and the pen and all you would do is pour the diamonds into the tray and sorry pull the pen pull the pen <laughs> take the pen press into the wax press into the diamonds press on the painting and voila you're officially a diamond painter <laughs> and do not worry if it breaks or if it runs away from you your next painting is going to have your back <laughs> and this is the painting it's a nice little mug of hot chocolate and i believe it's hot chocolate because there's a whole bunch of chocolate surrounding a it and the coloring reminds me of hot chocolate and i loved when i saw this little cup because it's so cute there's a little heart on it and i love that and it's just such a cute image and it's chocolate because i love chocolate <laughs> and i love the little steam and all of that i this image is so so cute and i really wanted to pick it up when i saw it so some information about the painting it is m 4408 into 20 by 20 and it is 13 colors oh yeah i can see that because the majority of the background is white i don't like it sorry I keep looking at the image <laughs> and for the legend it's all capital letters so woo, that's that's an easier one for me and i love that the legend shows all the different tones of brown <laughs> that's so cool i kind of like that I, I just i really i just really love this car this coffee cup i was gonna say uh, this chocolate mug i'm a big fan of it and just in case it is since it keeps not wanting to settle i'm gonna make sure to put a clear image here in the middle of the screen so you can see a little better but nice cup of hot cocoa is your salad as well <laughs> let me put it aside real quick and this is the next painting oops sorry about that i have a couple trays and they're kind of in the way of pretty much everything on the desk so these two paintings look the next two paintings look alike they're not i when i first received them i had to double check because i thought "Ooh, did i order two of them no they're kind of the same style but you'll see in a moment they're actually different so same thing diamond standard kit and as you can see these are actually in the little plastic packets so i save these little packets in case there's any loose diamonds like you saw in the previous painting so i'll make sure to put those together so i don't lose any diamonds because that's happened to me before and oh my goodness it's stressful but luckily i saved my diamonds so i can have backup <laughs> and as you can see there's a lot of really nice really dark kind of grays and i love this blue it's so random and i really like that blue color a couple of greens and grays in the middle two nice packets of our wonderful 3865 so i knew this is the background <laughs> and a nice leafy green oh i really like these colors and this is the painting oh my goodness as i said i knew it was going to be the background huh this is more white than i thought i um, well the teacup in the middle is kind of small as you can see huh that's kind of rare whenever i've done the teacup paintings but different teacups sorry from other 
from oh my goodness i apologize i don't know what i'm i'm trying to word it and i don't know why i can't say it right teacups in previous painting have always been really large they'll cover a good part of the drill field in the middle i'm kind of surprised that this one is really small in the middle huh that's interesting and it is it is a lot of the white background hmm I'm curious to work this up because since it's so small, I'm not too sure it will really kind of pop out for me because as you can see, the background's all white. The teacup as well is white in the middle. So I wonder if it will blend in and you're not going to see a lot of details in, on the cup. Hmm, this one's interesting. I'll think about doing this one next just out of my curiosity to see if I'll actually be able to see the cup itself. Huh. Sorry about that. <laughs> I started digging it myself. Apologies for that. And some information about the painting. It is PL055 and it's a 20 by 20. And there are 14 colors. And luckily the legend is all capital letters. I is a majority of it. <laughs> As you can see by the background, it's all I pretty much. This is interesting. And I do love the blue tones of the flowers. I do love the little cup. It's so, and you can actually see it's really subtle. The little handle here, huh? I am curious whether I should get this one up soon because now I do want to see what it looks like. Hmm. Let me know in the comments below if you're kind of curious about this as well, because I really do want to see what it looks like. Huh. Sorry about that. <laughs> and I'll make sure to put a clear image here in the middle of the screen so you can see the image more clearly. The small little teacup is your style too. <laughs> and for my last painting it's another teacup same thing with blue flowers on it as i said i originally thought i ordered the same one twice but no i caught that oh no it's a different painting and it's because it really does look like it like the other one a lot and sorry about that it's really stuck in the plastic and there we go let me put it aside real quick and it's the painting pearl it and these are the diamonds the, the standard kit as i said they always come back <laughs> and these are the diamonds Ooh, i really like those really dark tones you can see the nice browns and little nice dark grays i see you packets of white they're like <laughs> they're really in there and they're really thick while i'm holding them i can actually feel them again i know that's the background <laughs> i really like these colors and this is the painting as you can see how i kind of got a little confused because of the blue flowers in the cup but as you can see the reference compared to the other one actually let me pull up the other one the teacup compared to it is a lot smaller see how i said i thought that is weird that it's really really small so i think it's interesting that this painting has the teacup boom Right in the middle, <laughs> making sure everyone sees the steam in all its glory. <laughs> and I really love the blue flowers. So that's why I know that's why I picked it up because blue is my favorite color. So I was really excited when I saw the little blue flowers, little accents on the little saucer under the cup. And I just, I really like this one a lot. It's so cute. And I do have paintings already done on the side. I have them pretty much put all over my apartment, little random cups everywhere. It looks kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> but I do not have a problem making around, you know, 50 more. Whatever. <laughs> and so some information about the painting. It is M14 and it is a 20 by 20 and it's 14 colors. And again, this legend is all capital letters. So thank goodness that makes it easier. You can kind of see all the different grays and the subtle little browns. I believe from the tea and from the little accents all over the cup. I really do like this one a lot. But I really kind of want to do the other one. But I really need to finish other paintings. <laughs> I I really do love cups. And I do I did place an order for a couple more because since as I said holidays are coming up, there's a lot of a lot of hot chocolate mugs and coffee mugs as well. So I'm gonna make sure to buy some more. So you're gonna see some more cup paintings. <laughs> so yeah, that's all I wanted to show today. And I really, I, I really like this one. Sorry, I'm getting distracted again. And if you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate it. 
If you're new to the channel, all I ask is if you can do the usual. If you can like and subscribe, I really appreciate that as well. It really helps put the channel out there. And it really allows me the opportunity to show all of these wonderful paintings to everyone as well. <laughs> and before I end this, I've been noticing I've been getting new subscribers. So thank you for everyone that's been subscribing. And welcome to the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> and I just really wanted to make sure I wanted to thank everyone and everyone returning as well I really really do appreciate it last time I saw we're at 4 30 so we're getting up there everyone so woo, I'm, I'm just really excited about that and again thank you for your time and have yourself a wonderful day thank you <laughs>